Every year, one million people commit suicide in the world. That's one death every 40 seconds. Suicide is the third leading cause of death for those aged between 15 and 24 years old. Suicide rates have increased 60% in the last 45 years. A suicidal person feels like they have no meaning, no purpose, and no future. You know sometimes where you feel like you hide your pain pretty well? Well, so does a person sitting next to you. And you don't know what power we have to actually be a light into someone's life. To this experience, God has revealed a few things to me. And the first thing is when God presses on your heart to do something, stop, listen, and act. God gives us opportunity to reach out and be a light in the dark place. Here's a powerful story of how one night God tapped me on the shoulder and said, hey, go up to that person and ask how they're doing and if they're okay. And don't believe them when they say, I'm fine. I had enough. I saw no reason for living. I had no purpose in life anymore. I remember it was a cold night. I just wanted to get away. Away from everything. Away from my parents. Away from feeling out of place. I know I shouldn't have, but I hitchhiked. The man just kept driving. He ended up just dropping me off at a church. A guy was speaking at the church. He talked about how no one understood what he was going through. And that's how I felt. After church, I was sitting alone. As the person walked by, my heart sank. It was Nick. He came back and talked to me. Nick listened. Listened to my hurt. Listened to my frustration. I didn't feel alone anymore. Don't ignore his voice. Don't ignore that little idea that's pressed upon your heart and don't brush it off as if it's just a silly idea. I think of what would have happened if I actually didn't stop and I just ignored it. I was tired. I was preaching all day. It was cold outside. I wanted to go home. I was hungry. But I'm thanking God today that I stopped. Make sure that you stop. have a calling as a ministry to come alongside the next generation and encourage them to be passionately inspired to stand their ground as ambassadors of Christ. Help us pass along the torch to the next generation.